Um, yeah. You know, everybody rides scoots that have, they all ride these scoots that have just, just two wheels, just two, one on the front, one on the back. I still think that's overrated, just so we are all clear on that. Although, a lot of people still have problems with looping out. Today, we have a solution, a hack, if you will. Just like every single idea that we do on this channel, I don't know if this is gonna work. It's probably not, actually, now that I think about it. But I always say that, and somehow, sometimes it works. But, here's the plan. So we have these things. Oh God, this bar fits inside of the deck, like freaking perfectly. It's almost like they cut this out on purpose. So the plan is to drill a whole bunch of holes into this and we're gonna put as many wheels on this backside as we can. So we've made super wide scoot, like the monster truck scoot. This one is gonna specifically be the long-ish scoot. Building time. She's definitely got some weight to her, but we have all the wheels on the scoot right now. They're all held together by grade eight axles as well as like a few spacers. Couldn't get it super, super tight because it started to kind of bow in on the end of there. And, and if it bows in too much, these front wheels won't spin. This one's kind of cockeyed. Um, we just gotta leave it like that. I must've measured a little bit incorrectly because I didn't pay attention to the fact that this is 120 millimeter, not 100. So we're 20 millimeters off. Oops. But I am eager to get out into the skate park right now to try this thing out. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna call this yet. Like I said, absolutely no way you're gonna loop out on this thing, but let's see if it'll ride. Oh God. <gasps> This one's kind of screwing us up, this wheel right here, but we're gonna push through it. Hopefully it doesn't screw up my other wheel. Oh, Jesus. No kicklesses today, no kickless. Back foot bar spin. <laughs> nice little back heel bar spin from our boy Steve-O over here. Steve-O cruised out here with me because he wanted to get a set, so I figured since I was coming out here. There's all kinds of weird noises going on over here. Door's situated, no one's gonna come in here and, and get us. So I think it's time to test this thing out, but before we do, I want you guys to comment down below, what do you guys think is gonna happen with the scoot? Do you think it's gonna be able to ride? Do you think it's gonna be able to actually go straight and make it through all the tests that we put it through tonight? We're gonna take it throughout the skate park. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do a lot of things with this because I never actually do, but we're hoping for the best. Lots of scooter tricks to come. So before we actually get to actually riding this caterpillar slash extension slash whatever you want to call it, scoot. Devo wants to replicate the tail up that I did on the it's 50 pound scoot. <laughs> Dude, you just hit the ground. I uh, know, trust me, I, I remember. <laughs> Come on, dude, just get it. You have more room over here, try it right here. Dude, I'm gonna... <laughs> Let's get three more, let me just get one foot on there. One, one foot. Treat it, treat it like a skateboard. I love how because Steve-O is so light. Oh, don't don't ride that. James get pissed. I got in trouble. Every time he tries to do the tail up, it's so heavy that it just like it controls Steve-O completely. Dude. Without further ado, James gonna kill you. Let's try this thing out. We don't know if we're gonna be able to tail up this one, but we can definitely at least bar spin it. I just need to test how it tail out rolls like quick though. <laughs> that looks crazy. Oh, dude, you're flexing hard. Already? Rip. <laughs> Not even rolling. I think this calls for an extremely sharp transitioned quarter pipe. We gotta bend this thing back, dude. It's aluminum. You can bend it back. It won't snap or anything. I'll just snap. Poof! <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Sketch wool. Dude, she's good to go, mate. Good night. Let's go. Good lucky night. 
<laughs> it looks like a caterpillar. Oh! Is the tail coming up? Yeah, dude. The tail came up? Yeah, it's coming up like at least a couple inches. Should we go down and roll it? No, it'll bend so easily. Okay, we'll save that for the end. I want to take it off of the side of this. Dude, yeah. that would be sick. Yeah, I need to go the other way though. Oh, dude, I need to <gasps> Yo! <laughs> Dude, Haunting. it looks it looks so weird. It looks interesting. Yeah, like when you when you turn, it just like glides across the floor. <laughs> you wanna try it? Sure. Whatever you do, make sure you don't like tag, because <laughs> that'll be the end of the good old caterpillar scoop. What are we gonna call this? The extension cater. cater oh my god. Yeah, because the back doesn't come up very easily. If we're being 100% honest, try doing the jump thing that I just did. Right there. Right over there. It is. It is. Yeah, the bar was good. Oh my god! You know what would be interesting is if we were to only do like a couple wheels to see if we could flip very well. Hey, careful when you're going up that door. See, here's the problem. Because you're going down a transition, as soon as you go down this, that's gonna bend. So I feel like maybe we should do that first. Yeah, down that one, because it's kind of like a little more mellow. You know, I don't want to necessarily go down the wave of death. I try it. Oh, oh. That worked well. See, now that's that's what does it. Now you just yeah. Hey, careful, dude, that's gonna snap. Yo, no balls. Yeah, yeah don't do it, that's a terrible idea. Yeah. Let, me, let me try going down really quick. We're running into problems. She's starting to bend up a little bit. What do you think the weirdest scoot that I've ever made is? I don't think it's this one. I think it's the 122 wheel one. Dude. Hey, comment down below, you guys. Let me know what is the weirdest scoot in your personal opinion that I've ever made. You guys have probably seen a lot of the really weird videos, and if you haven't, Go ahead and click that card right there. There's a playlist with all kinds of really crazy scoots. And let me know which one you guys think is it's just way too out there, you know? But I want to do this little drop like Steve just did really quick. <laughs> there was no hesit. Oh, it looks like it looks like a dragster right now. We're gonna we're gonna have to do the rolling. Dude, dude I'm not not doing that. Dude. Right. You you would not be able to pay me to do that. Come on, dude. We could both do it. Why, dude? Cuz. Do you see how quick the transition on that is? Dude, I'm too scared. No, that's a 10 foot rolling. And then this sketchy scoot that could just grab and Hey, 10 kill foot rolling, 10 foot scoot. That's perfect. Do you remember the last thing that we dropped into this thing on was? No. Oh yeah, the wide yeah, bar. Yeah, you remember that? Connor, listen, Would you listen drop here. into this 10 foot rolling on this? Oh! That is why I'm not doing the step up. That is literally, I mean, the step up. The rolling, dude. I don't think it was this that screwed me up. I think it was just this wheel that's rubbing all cockeyed. <laughs> See how easily it grabs, dude? You're gonna die. It's this, this wheel is not rolling at all because it's bent inward, which means that my scooter can't roll, which means that if I would have drilled everything correctly and not all like unfortunate, is what I'm gonna use. We we probably be able be able to do it. We can't because my scooter's not rolling anymore. But we can hang five. No, we can't. Yes, we can. There's dude. no way. Shut up, dude. Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Let's see what you got, buddy. <laughs> Dang it! Hold up. I didn't say it was gonna be easy. Oh! <laughs> no way, dude. That was so good. That was good. Oh! There, there is a significant amount of weight that this adds to the rear end of the scooter. So, I mean. Do you want to try to hang five really quick? Just lean way more forward than you think. Whoa! All right, you guys, this thing is getting to the point where it's gonna start destroying my wheel very soon because of this gnarly bend right here. But I'm personally gonna classify that as a success. I think that was good. I, I mean, it, it made it, technically, it made it through the few tests that we did put it through. It took a long time to build because those stupid holes were messing with me, but it works. The Caterpillar Scoot works. Thank you for joining us in today's expedition. Good looking out. Make sure you guys go check Steve out on Instagram. Link will be in the description below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Shout out to Scooter Zone. Oh, right up there for letting us constantly come in here and essentially destroy and make really weird things like this. Thank you guys for giving me a key.
And we will also be having a meet and greet here at Megazone on February 9th. So if you guys want to cruise out, you want to grab yourself some merch, you want to be a part of the vlog, maybe be my Snapchat, Instagram, all that good stuff, make sure you guys come down over here to Megazone on February 9th. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, you want an outro? I have to go all the way up there? Come fly a bit. Oh. <laughs> Later. <laughs>